These were revealed just ahead of New York Comic Con this past weekend. And what makes this poster extra cool is the artist is Bob Gleason. And if that name rings a bell, it's because this is the same artist who created the iconic poster for Halloween 1978. You know the one I'm talking about, the one with the hand holding the knife, and it's a jack-o'-lantern just beyond the knife. He created that, and um, it kind of pays a little homage to it right here with that hand in, in dead center right there once again. But um, here, rather than the jack-o'-lantern, it is all Michael Myers. It is the shape. And uh, this was a special poster that they released just ahead of New York Comic Con where there was that panel honoring Jamie Lee Curtis, paying tribute to her 44 years as Laurie Strode in the Halloween movie franchise. And it was moderated by Drew Barrymore, which is really cool. And Fangoria actually um, talked to Bob Gleason about this new poster and... Um, and Bob says, quote, I actually painted multiple versions of it. It was fascinating to me how the character has changed, and I realized that it needed to be darker and more evil. Even within simple objects, the lighting and shading vary so much in the character. Definitely a really cool poster. I mean, it's simple. I like it in its simplicity. And, um, yeah, he does... It is pretty dark, you know, as we want it to be, as it should be. But again, it's just that simple, classic Michael Myers image. Michael with a big knife and that mask, the blackest eyes, the charred up coveralls. Um, you know, again, not reinventing the wheel, just paying homage. And I like it in its simplicity and showing off that mask, that ends mask as well. 